It's a movie. My life a movie. It's a movie. I don't like to do no acting, but I know my life will be a fucking movie. <laughs> hey you guys so um i just had an epiphany and decided to do a video because i'll be forgetting um not to do a video but i just be forgetting like i don't know occasionally i have to click back if you've seen my things i should have known video i'll be clicking back to that because i'll be forgetting like life lessons I have to go back and hear myself tell myself like don't yeah and you're probably wondering like why your videos when you be in the car this is my space my safe space this is where I be this is where I feel more comfortable this is where I read I have my journals right here on the side of my car look like this is myspace.com like this and so that's why I like my chit chat videos be me in my car that's where I reflect um but yeah I was just I just came from Walmart I had to get me a green machine um and I don't know like it was like a light bulb first of all it was just a series of events I just realized like I be too hard on myself and I just wanted to let whoever else know like don't be hard on yourself like it's life nobody makes it out alive like be easy and live life like appreciate everything and just appreciate the day by day you know accomplishments that you achieve like you know simple things like I be hard on myself because I be like Am I where I'm supposed to be at in life? Like, I feel like I'm supposed to be doing something else or farther ahead or I haven't done enough. And when I was researching earlier the difference between stocks and bonds, whatever, and then I read the definition of stock, and it was like, you're part owner of that company. And then when I was in Walmart, it was like, you is part owner of a company because I'm invested in different things. And then, like, I was sitting and I was like, you be hard on yourself like oh am i where i'm supposed to be am i doing what i'm supposed to be doing and it's like you're farther ahead than most people your age like there's people your age that haven't even thought about investing and here you are part owner of at least 25 companies and then i was like i don't even be acting like it not like that but like if you've seen my a sister tag video when my sisters were describing me you know those like I'm ambitious I'm a hard worker I'm independent you know and they look up to me because I've done a lot and I'm and I'm sitting there like what that's like yeah blah blah like you like set these goals and you accomplish them and like you've just done a lot for your age and I feel like I'm behind sometimes and I'm like what the hell like me I guess sometimes but what? No. But then I had to think like, Misha, you 25, at 25 years old, you're part owner of at least 25 companies. You had a house, you had a one bedroom, a two bedroom, a three bedroom, like two car garage, manicured lawn, backyard, family dogs, like you have came a long way. And don't be hard on yourself because you're on the right track. And I just had a... It hit me in Walmart when I was buying my juice. Like, are you invested in Walmart? Like, is you part owner of this shit up in here? Like, it just reflected on me. And I was like... Because I was talking about Ross earlier when I was on the clock. And I was like, I'm part owner of Ross. Like, it's just like things. Like, I'm part owner of Verizon. I partially own Snapchat. Thank you guys for using Snapchat. That's partially my business, my company. I'm partially, I'm a part owner, kind of like a CEO of Twitter or something. I don't know. I partially own them as well. Like, it's just like I'm part owner of all of these companies. And I be so hard on myself feeling like I'm not where I'm supposed to be. And I'm 
damn near ahead of the game like I don't know this video is just like I said to remind me cuz I be forgetting like chill out like I'm always like what am I supposed to be doing what am I, maybe I'm not saving enough maybe I'm not you know maybe I'm not doing enough maybe I'm not working where I'm supposed to be working now I'm always like a hundred miles per hour and it's like shoddy you good be easy like yeah and then even like when it comes to my son like if you've seen my most recent vlog like i'll be hard on myself as a parent like am i doing a good job am i like this with you because parenting is learning as you go you know so i'll be like am i i'm doing good all right and then i came home and he made me a picture and it was like the best mom i love you and it's like reassurance like thanks love like i needed this like thank you like i'm doing the best that i can and thank you for letting me know like this is right on time like i don't know so yeah just don't be hard on yourself everybody's exactly where they need to be where they supposed to be even the people that you i don't want to say lost but are no longer with you on your journey to where you're supposed to be going like everybody has their own path and some people I don't want to say aren't worthy of being at your destination when you get there, but everybody has different paths and not everyone can be along for your journey. You know what I mean? So, yeah, this was just for me to click back because I'll be still clicking back and be like, Nisha, what you doing? Letting people treat you any old type of way. Like, you can't talk to me like that. I'm part owner of 25 companies. Feel like i need to wear a suit all the time now like <sighs> like that just charged me up like that little light bulb because i'm telling you like you got my sisters i'd be like am i i don't know what i'm doing like i'll be telling them like i don't know what i'm doing in life like is this what i'm supposed to be doing like maybe i need a new job i've been here but then it's like nisha like you came to your job straight out of college your career straight out of college and it's the only job you've had but it's the only job you need like, I could retire here people have been here since I was 19 years old and here I am like maybe I need something else like like you good you doing what you went to college for be easy you 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 good you good and this video is just for me like I said to click back because I'll be forgetting and I be needing to hear my own voice be like, mm, if you don't, yeah. That's it, Nisha, and whoever else needed to hear this, but like, you good. <laughs> if you needed to hear, like, you know, you good. Even setbacks. Setbacks are not setbacks. Like, I want to get an arrow tattooed right here because... You know, an arrow, you pull it back so that it could be shot forward, you know. So I want to get an arrow tatted so that I can remind, like, my setbacks is not a setback. I'm going backwards so that I could be launched into something I would never imagined, you know. So even if you feel like you've been set back, like you're not. Something better is about to happen, I promise. Wait for it. And that's it logging out as partial owner of 25 companies I feel like a CEO now or something yeah and then I deal with depression too so that would be like uh, you ain't doing enough that's a whole another car talk but that's it if you click this thanks you might as well like it because it's the end and that's it all right guys have a good day something amazing is going to happen to you today and tomorrow watch